The build-up has been intense, and now we are just about ready to go. Make no mistake, the world is watching. It's the Copa Libertadores final. My name is Derek Ray, and joining me here on the commentary box is Lee Dixon. You can guarantee we're in for something special. So many storylines, Lee. Well, throw the form books out the window. This is a final. It's about the day. It's about who settles first. Carnport process, game plan. With all that noise going on, good luck. And he really is danger personified. But in this game, Lee, what do you think we might see from him? He's on the ball all the time, and his ability on the ball is absolutely phenomenal. He doesn't pass the ball away. He lends it to his teammates because he wants it back. Very difficult to get the ball off him. So we can check on the lineup today. A 4-4-2, but with a diamond lead. Yeah, there's four players in midfield, but really only three. The two wide players will stay wide and help the full-backs. There's one just sitting in front of the back four, but the number 10 is slightly advanced. He will provide the support for the strikers. Well, you know, Lee, if we'd been covering this tournament a couple of years ago, we'd have been covering it on the basis of two legs in the final. 2019, it was changed to one final, one match at a predetermined venue, Lima, in that case, when Flamengo beat River. Yeah, absolutely, and that's how finals should be. Just the one game, none of that two-legged nonsense. And I'm really pleased it's like that now. We're in for a really good game. I love finals, you know that, Derek. And that's an important intervention. Casco. De La Cruz. And slipped through beautifully. What can he do from here? Wonderful chip. Superb save. Well, the keeper gamble coming off his line, but it paid off. Well, they were clearly on the receiving end, so a free kick is next. He's been admonished by the referee. He's now got to walk something of a tightrope. Yeah, he knows exactly where he stands. Look at the referee, how he's told him off there. No yellow card, but certainly knows what the referee's thinking. Juan Quintero. An incisive pass. There it is! How about that for starters? Well, what a huge moment that might be for this club. The fans are going absolutely wild. Well, here's the replay. He didn't panic, did it? Decent strike, good technique. Bread and butter strike, really. But it's in the back of the net. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle. One nil then. giving them the gift of possession. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. An utterly disappointing cross, goal kick.
De La Cruz. Casco. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. He succeeds in clearing it. Fernandez. Lucas Martinez Cuarta. Pinola spraying passes around, almost waiting for the opposition to make a mistake. Quintero. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Juan Quintero. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. Salvio. Given away. And he takes on the shot. And putting his body on the line. Just wanted to get it out of there. Quintero. And Perez now. Poor attempt at a pass, really. And plenty of scope to be created in that wide position. It has to be! You never really know, Lee, if it's going to come off when you hit it on the volley in that fashion. Yeah, hero to zero. When he struck that, you think, wow, and then all of a sudden you realise where it's gone. Well, he knows they've missed a golden opportunity to extend the lead there, but they're still in the lead, not all doom and gloom. Well, the pass not finding its target. Suarez. Moving forward effectively. Danger averted. Pintero on the ball. Perez. Spot on with that tackle. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. And the offence sufficiently sinister to warrant a yellow card. Yes, agree with that one, Derek. He's got to be careful now. Well, the manager's not happy, is he? Can't blame him, really. Carlos Izquierdos. Campuzano. What a shocking pass, really. Juan Quintero. Well, sometimes you can't argue with top-notch defending. Javier Pinola. Can they get in behind them? A wayward effort, and it's not going to help his team, Lee. Well, wayward indeed. I think he had more time than he thought, and he just rushed it a little bit. Technique was all wrong. Casco and slipped through beautifully. Well, he put the cross into the right place, but no one able to finish it off.
Lopez. That's plenty of know-how in the ball shielding department. Strong play here. Tremendous ball played through. It's a cross towards the near post. That is when your goalkeeper is worth his weight in gold. Well, he's earned his wages, hasn't he? He was in position, he had his focus. What a save. We've been waiting to find out. Now we know a minimum of three added minutes here. Ignacio Fernandez. Space afforded him. It's got to be! Well, sadly, you've got to say, miles off target. Well, if it had just bent it or maybe just gone for a bit more accuracy, instead he went for the strong shot and he just fluffed his lines. Well, Derek, he's trying to make himself heard down there. Very difficult to hear the coach from the sidelines. It's still very tight, this game. Juan Quintero. And there it is, the half-time whistle. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Lucas Martinez Cuarta. Gonzalo Montiel. Oh, stylish ball. What can they do now? It needs an accurate cross. Well, that is a defender's job to come to the rescue. A good-looking move. Guillermo Fernandez running towards goal. Well, just couldn't keep himself onside. Fernandez. Javier Pinola. Lucas Martinez Cuarta. Quintero. Well, you've got to keep the ball a bit better than that. A bit sloppy in possession. Oh, he's given the ball away. High pressing at its best. Fernandez. Bore. Well, visionary passing. And nothing positive comes of it, unfortunately. Well, that's very smart defending, and now they have the ball again. No hiding from the fact that that was a very poor effort. Oh, look away right now. Look at that. Absolutely awful effort. Well, the manager can't hide his disappointment at not extending the lead there. He's still on a knife edge. Excellent vision. 
Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. So a throw in here. Substitution time it is. Well, it was a very good looking move, but alas, no end product. Zarate. Salvio. And they've only gone and applied that finishing touch. Well, the goal will not stand. It is offside. Yeah, good football there, but just straight offside. Perez. Pinola. Milton Casco. He might be able to profit from the wide position. Straight down the throat of the opposition. Shot attempted. The keeper was never likely to be in trouble then. It did appear that they might be onto something, but not so. Lucas Martinez Cuarta. We're now inside the final 20 minutes of the game. Fernandez. Plenty of running room in the wide position. De La Cruz. Giving it a try. And he got to it fairly easily. And very deftly cut out. And it's with Emmanuel Reynoso. Salvio. Salvio. He's got the right idea with that pass. Can he get them level? Well, just couldn't quite keep himself onside. The flag has gone up. Well, they've been getting... Getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. And they've been getting two substitutes warmed up, and both will come on here. Pintero on the ball. De La Cruz. Casco. And a chance for him on the flank. Well, just couldn't keep the ball. Well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. Lopez. Only ten minutes remaining here. Tevez. Almendra. He's found a pocket of space. Great opportunity. Rifled against the post, but back in play. Late drama here. Level once more. Incredible scenes. Well, here it is. You have to say they've come under an awful lot of pressure today. But it's a sucker punch. They've gone up the other end and got a well-taken goal. Well, let's have another view of that goal. Well, Derek, the frustration's boiling over on the touchline. He's not happy at all with the last five or ten minutes. Even Steven won a piece on this match.
De La Cruz. Possession changes hands, the interception there. Couldn't keep the ball. Buffarini, good technique displayed. Pinola. That is excellent pressure high up the pitch. Fernandez. Well, at first glance, you would think a strong possibility of a red card. Let's see. And he's going to get his marching orders for that intervention. Red card all the way. Well, definitely the referee's got that spot on. A really, really silly challenge, that is. Well, Derek, I'm not so sure I'd want to be a manager. Just look at the frustration on his face. They have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. And three minutes will be added on for stoppages. Three minutes of having time. Sadly, too many things wrong about that effort. Oh, everything was wrong about it. Body shape, positioning, the idea of where he was going to put the ball, it was all going wrong. It's a poor attempt, really, for him. De La Cruz they cannot be separated here and it's on to extra time And so the story continues, the first period of extra time, and no one is leaving. Well, fitness levels are going to be tested now, Derek. Almendra. Carlos Izquierdos. Lopez. Campuzano. Strong play here on the shielding front. Beautiful pass. No one had to think hard about that decision. Offside the verdict. Yeah, good line from the defence there. Ignacio Fernandez. It's all about translating threats into goals. Campuzano. On the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? And the referee decided that intervention was illegal and cautionable. Oh, without question, it was not the best of challenges. Well, we can see the coach doesn't think that's a yellow. Lovely first touch, that wasn't easy.
A chance maybe from the wide position. And threading it forward. Can they convert? And scope for the cross. It might be perfectly set up for the counter-attack, you know. This looks promising. Opportunity to take the lead. Well, it might still work out for them. Just cleared away in the nick of time. Two minutes and two. It's opening up for them. Wonderfully weighted pass. And the goalkeeper will see that as part of doing his job. Well, the teams are locked together. Will it stay that way following this corner? Corner kick played in, not messing around with that clearance. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. And thwarted there following the cross. Goalkeeper's ball every day of the week. Well, he's given it away. And the first period of extra time comes to an end. Still level here. Can they overcome tired legs? It's the second period of extra time underway now. Leonardo Ponzio. Casco. Ponzio. And that was a very fine read. And using his strength to shield the ball. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. They've regained possession. And he takes it on. Not to it easily, the keeper. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? It might be the moment to get them ahead. And they've only gone and applied that finishing touch. Well, here's the replay. What a time to score, Derek. You've got to believe they're going to be home and hopes now. Senior players talk to the youngsters. The game is nearly over. Well, 2-1 it is here. Julio Buffarini. Well, five minutes remaining in this the second period of extra time. He's using his strength to good effect. Almendra. Campuzano. to keep the ball a bit better than that. The referee has indicated... And he's made headway. Two minutes. And he's made it a brace for himself. 
the defender is just unable to stay with him and he's having a field day well let's have another look at it extra time has been there friend it was a good finish they've probably been better over two legs and now the game is virtually over slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored Oh, to be a fly on the wall in that dressing room, if it stays like this, Derek, he's not happy. Just look at him. So there it is, 3-1, the current scoreline here. And the issue has been settled in this Copa Libertadores final as we salute the winners and spare a thought at the same time for the losing team. But as they say in Spanish, the sueño libertador, the Libertadores dream has been realised. Well, it's relief more than anything. All that hard work, you get to the final, you do not want to lose it. And they'll celebrate long into the night for sure. That is a 100% guarantee. And now for the walk every player in South America wants to make. Awaiting them, that piece of sterling silver and their name will shortly be on the pedestal. Well, it's always superstition. Don't touch the trophy before you win it. And this lad's going to get his hands on it now. What a brilliant performance and well-deserved. The winners of the Copa Libertadores. And this is only the start of what will be wild celebrations, Lee. Well, it's deserved as well, all that hard work during the season, all those training ground hours, and also the families as well. They'll enjoy this because they sacrifice stuff as well when the players are away. Well, they certainly never forget their supporters. And right now, they are at one with them. Yeah, absolutely, Derek. This is the closest you ever feel to the supporters sharing this moment. Shame you can't jump the fence and share the cup. Don't get any ideas about that, Lee. <laughs> We're a long way from it here on the commentary position. But really, magnificent scenes, whatever way you slice it. And now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken. Well, you know exactly where I'd be sitting in that photo, don't you, Derek? <laughs> I think I've heard it before, Lee. <laughs> Straight at the front.